Hi historians, welcome to a quick video from me, Julie Johnson, your professor this semester. Um, I thought I would throw some quick videos in here to help guide us and um, as you're starting chapter two in your text for this week, I ask in your journal that you look at some of the artwork at the end of the chapter. There's some great primary sources in our text that we'll be using throughout the semester. Um, some of the art in the text from chapter two is looking at colonial art. And so I just wanted to take a quick um, moment to look at two portraits with you. Um, these are two portraits. The second portrait, a figure 2.6, is actually in your textbook. This is Elizabeth Frakey and her child. Um, her husband, John, is uh, actually presented on the other side. And I kind of want us to just think about what the differences are between the man and the woman painted in these two pictures. So likely these pictures were painted by an artist who was called a limner, someone who would travel around from home to home or town to town and offer to do portraits of people in the town. The questions I want you to think about are, do you think these uh, frakies are wealthy? Do you think that the husband is represented differently than the wife and child? What are the, some observations you can make about his stature, his presentation in the portrait, and the presentation of Elizabeth and her child Mary? What are the differences between the two, and what do the, those differences say about these people in these colonial times? Thanks and have fun!